Hello and welcome to Saturday. I am feeling a lot better. Um, I have been sick for quite a few days, but today I am feeling a lot better. Still sick, um, but I'm definitely on the up and up. Uh, it's moved into a cough, which seems bad and is certainly terrible for recording, but generally anytime I felt like this in the past and I start coughing, it means that I just have another day or two of it. And uh, just in general, I feel much, much, much better. I've been coughing a lot, but I feel like I probably just have a few more days and I'll be good to go. Um, I'm also feeling up to actually building this computer. Uh, if you missed the vlog a few days ago, we received a bunch of parts uh, courtesy of uh, Andreas, uh, one of our uh, extremely generous viewers. And we need to actually put this thing together. So I decided, you know what? Let's build a computer. Now if you missed the vlog the other day, I'm going to go over the parts that we're actually uh, putting into this thing. We've got the Define uh, R4 computer case. We've got the GeForce GTX 980 Ti video card. Uh, our power supply is the Seasonic Platinum uh, 860 watt. Uh, this is a uh, four terabyte Western Digital Black Drive. We also have a Samsung 512 gigabyte uh, 950 Pro uh, SS, uh, what is it, the PCI SSD. Um, we've got 16 gigs of DDR4 Crucial Ballistics RAM, an i5 6600K uh, CPU, a Z170A motherboard uh, by Asus, and a NHD15 cooler by Noctua. Now we have built um, several computers on the vlog before, and generally we do it a little more meticulously, and we show you know, what we're doing and uh, bit by bit. But I think this time, um, because it's, it's already late in the day, we've had a big day otherwise, I think I'm going to just put the GoPro up and do kind of a time lapse of me building this thing. I don't know how exactly how long it'll take, um, but the uh, the actual building part is usually the easy part. Um, I've built a lot of Hackintoshes. Once again, building it's easy. Getting OS X to run on it's hard, but because we're actually putting Windows on this thing, it shouldn't be too bad, which is exciting. So I'm going to get the GoPro set up. We're going to start building this thing. Unfortunately, the GoPro died about probably halfway through, um, which is a shame because the second half actually went a lot faster, but it's done! Um, everything is done. It was, it was pretty straightforward and easy. There was a few confusing things. Uh, for one, at the beginning, I had so much trouble with the faceplate. I don't know why. I, that's the last thing I would expect to have a problem with, but um, the faceplate went, uh, went into the case easy, but then I couldn't get the, the motherboard through the faceplate. I have no idea why, but eventually I, I managed to get it. Um, otherwise, everything went pretty, pretty easy. Um, I did the CPU and I got this uh, cooler. This cooler is gigantic. Like this thing is crazy. And the second fan is optional, um, but it does, it does fit. Uh, you'll notice that it's actually sitting a little higher than this one. I don't think it's going to be a problem just because the RAM is actually under it. It's not touching, but it's, you know, it's close. Um, if it's a problem, this can come off. Uh, it, it, it's probably okay. Uh, otherwise, everything's connected. This thing takes a lot of power. Um, the the only thing that was really confusing was these little uh, this little M2 um, SSD because I've never used one of those before. But there's a special slot on the motherboard for it, and there's a screw that you use um, to mount it to the motherboard. And we could not find that screw. And then after racking our brains for like 10 minutes, it occurred to us that we had been going through the screws that were included with the case and not the motherboard. And then we felt really stupid. And then we found the, the screw and it was fine. So now everything's hooked up. Um, it, it really, we're just gonna power it on and, and see if it, 
if it works. I don't have a copy of Windows to install yet. I'm going to work on that uh, tomorrow, I think. But right now, if we can get to the the beep of, hey, this is working, good job you, then I will be satisfied for tonight. I have it hooked up through HDMI. Oh. Oh, there we go. Asus, in search of incredible. Okay. Well, good. It seems to be working. No keyboard detected. But this is... This is on. <coughs> it detects the CPU. It detects the memory. And it's not currently melting. Also, it's very quiet. Like... Like, I actually can't hear it quiet. But I can see the fans running. Wow. It also has a, um, a fun little door on front. Anyway, this is as far as we're getting tonight. It's pretty late. Um, the build took uh, a little bit longer than I wanted it to, uh, but also I'm sick, so I give myself a pass. Uh, I'm going to figure out Windows tomorrow. Um, I want to put Windows 10 on it, and right now they're doing a thing where if you have Windows 7, you can upgrade to 10 for free. And I have Windows 7, but I'm currently using it because I'm playing Bioshock, and uh, honestly, I don't want to touch anything related to that, because right now it's working, and I'm in the middle of a Let's Play, so what I'm going to do is I think I'm just going to buy Windows 10, and then when we get Mal's computer going, and she is using um, a Windows computer, then I will just let her use my Windows 7 and upgrade that to 10 for free, so we don't miss out on that free upgrade deal because we ultimately will probably want two copies of Windows 10 anyway, and this will help me keep my Windows 7 running so Bioshock doesn't explode. But um, anyway, that's that. And uh, once again, super huge thank you to uh, Andreas and Sarah for, for sending this our way. This is super kind and super generous, and I'm really excited to see what this thing can do. Um, and hopefully we'll get a chance to maybe see a little bit of that tomorrow, but um, it's a bit of a process. We've got the thing built, now we have to get Windows on it, and uh, and then, you know, get Grand Theft Auto downloaded, because that'll be fun. Alright, thanks for watching. I'm still sick. Hopefully I'll feel even better tomorrow. Are you starting to get sick? I think so. My mom got, it was starting to get sick today, too, so now everyone will have been sick, because my dad was sick, I was sick, mom is getting sick, and then she might be next, so fingers crossed she doesn't, but we'll see what happens. Let's be back tomorrow, shall we? <coughs> Huh. <sighs>